Nestled in a picturesque valley between the majestic Denaric Alps, Sarajevo is a captivating multicultural city surrounded by natural beauty. Make sure to watch until the end as we saved the best thing to do in Sarajevo for last. Remember to like this video and subscribe to our channel for the best travel information about Europe. We use a mix of travel experience, a lot of local knowledge and reviews to provide you with the most reliable and relevant travel information in Europe. So be sure to visit our website for the biggest travel website about Europe. Sarajevo is the capital and largest city of Bosnia and Herzegovina on the Balkan Peninsula. It's situated in the Sarajevo Valley by the Miljaka River, surrounded by the Dinaric Alps. The city is positioned at the crossroads of Eastern and Western Europe, with a population of around 400,000 residents. One of the first things that strikes visitors to Sarajevo is its diverse architectural heritage. As you wander through its streets, you'll encounter a rich tapestry of styles, including Ottoman, Austro-Hungarian and modern structures, as this city is literally where the East meets the West. Sarajevo's multiculturalism is truly captivating and plain to see. Often referred to as the Jerusalem of Europe, the city is a mosaic of cultures, where Bosniaks, Croats, Serbs and other ethnic groups coexist harmoniously. This diversity is reflected in the city's cuisine, which offers a delightful fusion of Turkish, Mediterranean and Central European flavours. The city's turbulent past is also evident in the present. Sarajevo bears the scars of the Bosnian War, but these marks stand as a testament to the resilience of its people and the pursuit of peace. Bullet-riddled buildings serve as a poignant reminder of the conflict, while museums and memorial sites provide a deeper understanding of the city's history. Additionally, Sarajevo's natural surroundings are simply breathtaking. From hiking in the nearby hills to skiing on the slopes of the Dinaric Alps, the city provides a stunning backdrop for adventure and exploration. But let's start with a short introduction to the city's history. Sarajevo has a long and storied history that dates back to ancient times. It became a significant settlement during the Roman period and later came under the rule of the Ottoman Empire in the 15th century. The city flourished as an important trading hub along the Silk Road. In the 20th century, Sarajevo experienced turmoil and major historic events, including the assassination of Archduke Franz Ferdinand in 1914, which sparked World War I, and the devastating Bosnian War in the 1990s. Today, Sarajevo is a modern and peaceful city, with its rich historical legacy and multicultural heritage shaping its present. Now let's take a look at the top 10 things to do in this amazing city. Number 10. Explore the White Fortress. The White Fortress, also known as Biela Tabia, is a historic fortification located in Sarajevo. Perched on a hilltop overlooking the city, the fortress holds great significance in the region's history. Dating back to the 16th century, the White Fortress was initially built during the Ottoman Empire's rule. Its strategic location provided a vantage point for monitoring and defending the city against potential threats. Over the centuries, the fortress underwent several modifications and renovations. The White Fortress earned its name due to the white limestone walls that once enclosed the fortification. Unfortunately, much of the original structure was destroyed over time, leaving behind only remnants of its former glory. However, the fortress still offers captivating panoramic views of Sarajevo and its surrounding landscapes. Today, the White Fortress serves as a popular tourist attraction and a peaceful retreat for locals. Visitors can explore the remaining ruins, walk along the fortification's walls and enjoy the breathtaking vistas of Sarajevo's Old Town and the Miljaka River. The White Fortress stands as a tangible reminder of Sarajevo's rich history and cultural heritage. 
Its ruins and scenic setting make it a must-visit destination for history enthusiasts and travellers seeking to immerse themselves in the city's past. Number 9. Take a day trip to the Olympic Mountains A day trip to the Olympic Mountains from Sarajevo, such as Jaurina or Bielasnica, offers an exciting opportunity to explore the natural beauty and outdoor activities that Bosnia and Herzegovina has to offer. Jaurina, located just a short distance from Sarajevo, was one of the main venues for the 1984 Winter Olympics. This mountain boasts stunning landscapes and a range of activities throughout the year. In winter, it transforms into a popular ski resort, with well-maintained slopes suitable for all skill levels. Visitors can enjoy skiing, snowboarding and other winter sports. During the summer months, Jaurina becomes a haven for hikers and nature enthusiasts, offering picturesque trails and breathtaking views from its peaks. Bialasnica is another Olympic mountain easily accessible from Sarajevo. Renowned for its rugged beauty, it offers diverse activities for outdoor enthusiasts. In winter, Bialasnica is a paradise for skiers and snowboarders, featuring challenging slopes and a vibrant apres ski scene. During the warmer months, visitors can partake in hiking, mountain biking and paragliding, taking in the panoramic vistas of the surrounding landscapes. Both Jaharina and Bielasnica provide a range of amenities, including accommodation, restaurants and equipment rental facilities. Additionally, they offer opportunities to immerse in the local culture and cuisine, making the day trip a well-rounded experience. Whether you seek adventure on the slopes or tranquility amidst nature, a day trip to the Olympic Mountains from Sarajevo promises unforgettable memories and a chance to appreciate the stunning beauty of this region. Number 8. Try Bosnian Cuisine Bosnian cuisine is a delightful blend of Ottoman, Austro-Hungarian and Balkan influences, resulting in a unique culinary experience that's definitely worth trying. Sarajevo's diverse food scene showcases the rich cultural heritage of Bosnia and Herzegovina, and you can have a taste at one of the many local restaurants or join a food tour in Sarajevo. One of the signature dishes you should try is cevapi, small grilled minced meat sausages served with flatbread, onions and sour cream. This iconic street food is incredibly flavorful and a beloved local favorite. Another must try is burek, a savory pastry filled with minced meat, cheese, spinach or potatoes. Burek is a staple in Sarajevo and is often enjoyed for breakfast or as a snack. Additionally, Sarajevo offers a wide range of desserts and sweets. Try baklava, a sweet pastry made of layers of phyllo dough filled with ground nuts and soaked in syrup, or tufahia, a poached apple stuffed with walnuts and served with sweet syrup and whipped cream. Sampling Bosnian cuisine in Sarajevo is an opportunity to explore the city's culinary heritage and indulge in a variety of flavors and textures. The blend of traditional recipes, regional influences and fresh ingredients makes it a memorable experience that will leave you craving for more. Number 7. See the Sarajevo Eternal Flame The Sarajevo Eternal Flame is a powerful symbol of remembrance and a tribute to the victims of World War II and the more recent Bosnian War. It's situated in the heart of the city, near the vibrant Ferhadje Street. The eternal flame is a perpetual flame that burns continuously, representing the everlasting memory of those who lost their lives in the wars. It serves as a solemn reminder of the sacrifices made by countless individuals and the resilience of the people of Sarajevo. Visiting the Sarajevo Eternal Flame provides an opportunity to pay respects and reflect on the devastating consequences of war. It's a place of quiet contemplation, 
and serves as a focal point for locals and visitors alike to remember the past and promote peace and unity. By visiting the Sarajevo Eternal Flame, you can honor the memory of those who lost their lives, gain a deeper understanding of the city's history, and contribute to the collective efforts of remembrance and reconciliation. It's a somber yet essential experience that encourages reflection and fosters a commitment to a peaceful future. Number six, visit Sarajevo City Hall. Sarajevo City Hall, also known as Vyechnica, is a magnificent architectural gem located in the heart of Sarajevo. It stands as a symbol of the city's rich history and cultural significance. This grandiose building was constructed in the late 19th century and showcases a captivating blend of Moorish revival and Austro-Hungarian architectural styles. The exterior of Sarajevo City Hall is adorned with intricate carvings, while the interior boasts a breathtaking fusion of Oriental and European influences. Its elegant details, graceful arches and decorative motifs create a visually stunning experience for visitors. However, the significance of Sarajevo City Hall extends beyond its architectural beauty. It witnessed numerous key events in Sarajevo's past, including the assassination of Archduke Franz Ferdinand in 1914, and survived two world wars. After suffering extensive damage during the Bosnian War in the 1990s, the City Hall was meticulously restored and reopened in 2014. Visiting Sarajevo City Hall offers a captivating journey through time and a glimpse into the city's tumultuous past. Inside, you can explore the richly decorated halls, marvel at the intricate ceiling frescoes, and browse through the extensive collection of books in the National Library. A visit to Sarajevo City Hall is not only an opportunity to appreciate exquisite architecture, but also a chance to immerse yourself in the history and cultural heritage of Sarajevo. Number five, take a stroll along the Miljaka River. A stroll along the Miljaka River offers a delightful and scenic experience, showcasing the natural beauty and urban charm of the city. The Miljaka River flows through the heart of Sarajevo, cutting through the valley and dividing the city into its eastern and western parts. Walking alongside the river allows you to immerse yourself in the captivating ambience of Sarajevo. The riverbanks are lined with picturesque promenades, lush green parks and charming cafes, creating a perfect setting for a leisurely stroll. The sound of the flowing water, the gentle breeze and the panoramic views of the surrounding hills make for a tranquil and refreshing escape from the bustling city. You might even encounter wildlife, such as grey heron straddling the river. As you walk along the Miljaka River, you will encounter several notable landmarks. The Latin Bridge is the most famous of all of them, but the Bridge of Suada and Olga, a memorial bridge dedicated to the victims of the Bosnian War, stands as a reminder of the city's resilience and the importance of peace. Moreover, the riverbanks host various cultural events, exhibitions and festivals throughout the year. From outdoor concerts to art installations, there's always something happening along the Miljaka River that adds vibrancy and excitement to your stroll. Visiting the Miljaka River provides a unique perspective on Sarajevo's beauty, history and cultural life. Whether you're seeking a peaceful retreat, exploring the city's landmarks or simply enjoying the charming atmosphere, a leisurely walk along the Miljaka River is a delightful experience that should not be missed during your visit to Sarajevo. Number four, visit the Sarajevo War Tunnel Museum. The Sarajevo War Tunnel Museum, located in Sarajevo, Bosnia and Herzegovina, is a poignant reminder of the city's turbulent past during the Bosnian War. 1992 to 1995. 
The museum is dedicated to preserving the memory of the war and the vital role played by the Sarajevo Tunnel, also known as the Tunnel of Hope. The Sarajevo Tunnel was a lifeline for the city during the war, providing a clandestine route that connected the besieged city to the outside world. It served as a vital supply line for food, weapons and humanitarian aid, enabling the survival of the citizens of Sarajevo amidst the harsh conditions of the conflict. Visiting the Sarajevo War Tunnel Museum offers a deeply immersive and educational experience. You can explore a section of the original tunnel, gaining insight into the challenging circumstances faced by the residents of Sarajevo. The museum exhibits include photographs, videos, personal testimonies and artefacts from the war, providing a comprehensive understanding of the city's struggle and resilience. By visiting the Sarajevo War Tunnel Museum, you will not only learn about a significant historical event, but also gain a deeper appreciation for the human spirit and the ability to endure in the face of adversity. It's a place of remembrance, paying tribute to the suffering endured by the people of Sarajevo and serving as a reminder of the importance of peace and understanding in our world today. Number three, cross the Latin Bridge. The Latin Bridge is an iconic historical landmark that holds immense significance. This bridge spans the Meliaca River and is famously associated with a momentous event in world history, the assassination of Archduke Franz Ferdinand of Austria-Hungary on June 28, 1914. The Latin Bridge, known in the Yugoslav era as Principov Most or Princip's Bridge, connects the old and modern parts of the city. It was originally built in the Ottoman era and got its name as it connected the right bank of the Miljaka with the Catholic Quarter on the left bank, known then as the Latin Quarter. It's a beautiful stone bridge with a single arch, featuring elegant and understated design elements. As you walk across the bridge, you can enjoy charming views of the river and the surrounding architecture. Visiting the Latin Bridge offers a unique opportunity to step into the footsteps of history. It marks the exact spot where Gavrilo Princip, a Bosnian Serb student, assassinated Archduke Franz Ferdinand, sparking the chain of events that led to the outbreak of World War I. This assassination is widely considered a turning point in modern history, setting the course for the entire 20th century. Today, the Latin Bridge not only stands as a physical structure, but also serves as a symbol of remembrance and reflection. It's a site of historical commemoration, with plaques and a museum dedicated to the assassination. Exploring the museum, you can learn about the events leading up to the assassination, examine artifacts related to the event, and gain a deeper understanding of the complex history of the region. A visit to the Latin Bridge allows you to connect with a pivotal moment in history and contemplate the far-reaching consequences of individual actions. It serves as a poignant reminder of the fragility of peace, a bridge between the East and the West, the future and the past. Whether you're a history enthusiast, interested in architecture or seeking a deeper understanding of Sarajevo's past, the Latin Bridge offers a thought-provoking and memorable experience. Number two, visit the Ghazi Huzrev Bey Mosque. The Ghazi Huzrev Bey Mosque is a magnificent architectural gem and a symbol of the city's Islamic heritage. Built during the Ottoman era in the 16th century, this mosque is named after Ghazi Huzrev Bey, a prominent Ottoman governor. The mosque showcases a stunning blend of Ottoman and Islamic architectural styles. Its grand domes, minarets and intricate calligraphy create a captivating sight. Inside, you'll find exquisite geometric patterns, colourful ceramic tiles and beautifully crafted woodwork that contribute to a serene and spiritually uplifting atmosphere. Visiting the Ghazi Huzrev Bey Mosque offers a unique opportunity to explore Sarajevo's rich Islamic culture and history. As an active place of worship, 
it provides a glimpse into the religious life of the local Muslim community. Observing the rhythmic prayers, experiencing the peaceful ambience, and witnessing the devotion of worshippers can be a deeply meaningful experience. The mosque is also home to the Ghazi Husraf Bay Library, one of the oldest and most significant Islamic libraries in the Balkans. Its collection of manuscripts, books and rare documents makes it a treasure trove for scholars interested in Islamic studies. A visit to the Ghazi Husraf Bay Mosque allows you to appreciate its architectural splendor, delve into the Islamic heritage of Sarajevo and gain a deeper understanding of the city's multicultural fabric. Whether you're interested in history, architecture or seeking a spiritual experience, this iconic mosque offers a truly enriching journey. Number 1. Explore Bas Garcia and the Sabil Fountain The number one thing to do in Sarajevo is to visit Bas Garcia, the old town of Sarajevo a historic and cultural neighborhood that offers a captivating glimpse into the city's rich heritage. Dating back to the Ottoman era, Baskarsia is a vibrant hub that enchants visitors with its traditional craftsmanship, narrow cobblestone streets and bustling atmosphere. At the center of this neighborhood lies the Sebil Fountain, an iconic symbol of Sarajevo. The Sebil Fountain is an exquisite wooden structure adorned with intricate carvings. It has served as a meeting point and a source of drinking water for centuries, symbolizing communal life in Sarajevo. Visiting the Sebil Fountain allows you to witness the intersection of history, architecture and local culture. The fountain's ornate design and historical significance make it a popular spot for taking photographs and soaking up the atmosphere of Baskarsilla. Exploring Baskarsilla is a delight for the senses. The neighborhood's vibrant market stalls, traditional workshops and the aroma of Bosnian coffee create an immersive experience. Indulge in delectable Bosnian cuisine, shop for handmade crafts or simply wander the streets, absorbing the lively ambiance. Bas Garcia is also home to notable attractions like the Ghazi Husraf Bay Mosque, the Bezistan Marketplace and the Morika Han Caravanserai. These landmarks offer insights into Sarajevo's diverse heritage and provide opportunities to learn about the city's history and cultural traditions. In summary, a visit to Bas Garcia and the Serbil Fountain is a must for anyone seeking to explore the captivating charm of Sarajevo. Immerse yourself in the historical and cultural tapestry of the neighborhood, engage with friendly locals and savor the unique experiences that make Bas Garcia an unforgettable destination. That's the end of our video of the top 10 things to do in Sarajevo. Check out more amazing videos on our YouTube channel or visit our website to find the best travel deals to Europe. See you next time.